Donna McDonald has a heavy heart thinking about the tragedy that's taken over the lives of her neighbors, James and Dolly Bates. Oh, I just, I thought it was horrible. I couldn't believe it. I, I kept hoping, hoping, you know, it's not him. Maybe it's not him. A horrible accident putting her neighbor in intensive care. James Bates was mowing grass near this canal Monday afternoon when he flipped into the water and became trapped underneath. My heart went out to his wife because I can imagine how she was feeling watching him drowning in there and there's nothing she could do. Bates's wife Dolly, who works with him, was in the front yard and didn't see exactly how it happened, but sensed something was wrong when she heard her husband's mower stop running. She ran back, saw the machine in the water, and called 911 for help. Okay. 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 Is he awake? I don't know. I can't see. Is he breathing? He had the lawnmowers on top of him. I don't know. The lawnmowers on top of him, you said? <laughs> yes, he's in the water. James! Emergency crews were able to free him from the canal. And while James Bates is now fighting for his life, neighbors are reflecting on the good time spent with the family. They'd stand out there and talk for hours. <laughs> he used to come over here and talk to my husband all the time. And if he needed help, uh, my husband Steve would go over and help him and vice versa. And they're keeping their fingers crossed for a full recovery. I wish them all the best and I pray that God gives them the strength and courage to get through this.